what is a lukewarm Christian? A lukewarm Christian is someone who claims to be a follower of Christ, but still lives like the world. Here are 10 signs of a lukewarm Christian. Number one, a lukewarm Christian compromises with the word of God. So lukewarms are often afraid of speaking the truth in fear of being rejected or being unliked. Lukewarms tend to usually stay quiet about certain topics because they know that they might receive backlash. But as believers in Christ, we need to stand firm on what God says and we need to back up the Bible. Number two, justification. A lukewarm Christian tends to justify their sin by taking scripture out of context and twisting scripture to fit their narrative. Number three, a lukewarm Christian does not feel conviction when they sin. They love sinning. If you're truly walking with Christ, you will not love sin. You will hate sin. And yes, we all fall short of the glory of God, but you will feel conviction and remorse and you will be trying to turn away from that sin. Number four, they do not read the word of God and they do not study the word of God. Someone who has a personal relationship with God knows that we need to be in our word and we need to renew our minds daily. So someone who's not being accountable and getting in the word of God might be a lukewarm Christian. Number five, they do not exhibit the fruits of the spirit. When you walk with Christ, he will slowly transform you and he will start to give you the fruits of the spirit, which are love, peace, kindness, patience, self-control. So if you do not have any of these fruits, then this is a sign that you might be a lukewarm. Number six, they do not repent. As believers in Christ, we know that even we need to repent when we fall short of God's glory. So someone who does not repent shows no fear for the Lord. Number seven, you believe good deeds will get you into heaven. Just because someone goes to church and just because someone does good deeds does not mean that you are going to make it to the kingdom of heaven. Number eight, you fear the punishment of sin more than sin itself. Number nine, you're superficial, so you only go to God when you need something, or you only love people who benefit you. And number 10, you are ashamed of God. You do not publicly proclaim your relationship with God. The Bible tells us not to be ashamed of the gospel. The Bible also tells us if you deny the Lord here on earth, he will deny you in heaven. So don't be secretive about your relationship with God. Go out and share the good news.